Dr. Carter here at Lexington Podiatry and this young lady came in to see us today for some really bad dry cracked feet. Well, the minute I looked at it, I thought psoriasis and she does have a history of it, but it's only been on her scalp and never on her feet before. So this could be a first. Um, instead of just treating it haphazardly, I want to make sure that I know what we're dealing with and that there is no fungal component. So we're going to do a biopsy today. Now, a biopsy kind of freaked her out too because she didn't really know what that was and it doesn't normally hurt because we do numb it. Um, a biopsy on the bottom of the foot is a lot worse than one up here because the skin is more soft and flexible, not so thick, and you don't walk on it all the time. Are you allergic to any numbing medicines, my dear? Okay. So we're gonna freeze the skin up above it. The nerve comes down, so as long as I go above it, then we're gonna make sure that we get it. We'll spray some cold stuff on her to help freeze her. And then we're gonna poke in just right underneath the skin and inject a little bit of Marcaine with epinephrine. I choose to use epinephrine in my injections because I don't want the surgical side to bleed any more than it has to. Perfect. All right, so that is the pre-game show. We're gonna let it get real nice and numb, and then we'll be back in a minute. Right, we've got her all numbed up and cleaned with betadine. Now we're gonna test her. Can you feel that? Perfect. All right, this is our little three millimeter punch bobsy. We come directly, directly, let's try that again, into it. We twist, 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 it punctures. 45 degree angle and we pull it back out. Now, if we hadn't used the epinephrine, it would be bleeding a lot more than it is. There's our little specimen. Um, and we're gonna put that into a formula container that my lovely assistant has prepared for me. Perfect. Thank you. Yeah, it's out, my dear. Wow. Now, we put a good amount of antibiotic ointment. We use Bactra, or Bacitracin, I'm so sorry, here in the office. We're gonna do a quite a large amount just because it has the tendency to stick if it bleeds. And so I don't want it to stick and hurt. Okay. Now, as she starts to walk, of course, blood flow starts pumping and we could get some leakage. So we put some Coban on here and try to make sure that we compress it just a little bit. All right, and there we have it, folks. That is a punch biopsy. So there's no reason to be scared. If you have something that is unusual on you, feel free to come in and let us evaluate it and you'll know what to expect.